Hello everyone, it's Noelle back with our 21st out of 100 original characters. Today's character is Sylvia who has pink hair and a cool deep skin tone done in colored pencils. I absolutely love pink hair for my characters and in real life as well, so you can imagine my excitement when I started the coloring process for Sylvia. I'm so sorry Susie. I had to be observant on how Sylvia's hair moves on her head so I could color it as realistically as I could. I mean, I could have just as easily went the anime route and colored the whole thing one solid block of color with just a band of the crown of her head for highlight, which that gives me an idea perhaps for other characters, but I really wanted to try my hand at the former. I absolutely love her hair swirls. <laughs> if you joined me for any of my vlogs, I mentioned that Sylvia wasn't drawn with the 100 OC challenge in mind. She was just a person who popped into my head and I had to sketch her out. Call it cheating if you want, but I'm going to need all the help I can get if I'm going to get 100 characters drawn and colored by the end of the year. I'm so sorry that I bounce around the timeline of my life in these videos, but I always find something pops into my head before I write these scripts. So I believe I talked about, or at least some of you guys know, my first anime was Digimon. Well, once I really started watching it, I never let it go. Guys, I stayed up late for an entire summer writing Digimon fanfiction. And yes, I still do have the story. It has been kept safe all these years and even to this day, over 17 years later, I still haven't finished it. It's like 50 pages of beautiful Digimon glory and it is so cringy. <laughs> During a summer, I also wrote several Digimon quote unquote comics. I would even draw Digimon characters or draw anime style anything almost every day at school. I have a video where I actually show these cringy Digimon drawings that you can watch if you click the little icon at the top. The video is a little old since I feel like I change the style of my videos constantly, but it's there, it's a good time, get a snack, sit back, try not to choke from laughing. <laughs> However, my obsession with Digimon lasted through till about the third season, which even to this day I still haven't seen in its entirety, because at that point I started getting into Toonami watching Yu Yu Hakusho and Ruani Kenshin, but as they say, all good things come to an end. Sylvia's all done! Thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up, and if you want to see more art-related content, I would totally appreciate if you would subscribe, and remember to draw what you love and love what you draw.